You had no authority. None. Mexico City. What were you doing there? I was taking some overdue holiday. Um, talk a little bit about the where and when you found out you'd be uh, cast in the movie. Where I found out on the phone. And when I don't really remember. Because, you know, it's like a long process. You, you start talking about the possibility and you look into the and you meet the people and, you know, then it kind of emerges into, uh, into something that then, in hindsight, looks like decisions. Why did you come? I came here to kill you. I did a casting in uh, like one year ago and um, I did like uh, two readings and then I met Sam. He didn't say yes immediately. I waited for like a few months, like maybe three months to know if I was going to be part of it. I didn't really know. But I, I so I was in London. He called me and he said, you can't, you can't read the, the script, but you, you, you can be part of it if you want to. Get away from me! Why should I trust you? Because right now, I'm your best chance of staying alive. Well, it was, you know, a little bit of a process, not like the process with Guardians, but it was a little bit of a process. When my agent called me with my manager, which is usually the case, and they said, they just threw it out there, hey, how would you feel about being in the James Bond film? And I was like, hell yeah, and I knew they were just asking me to be, you know, just a formality, but I knew they knew what my answer was gonna be. And I was like, hell yeah, are you kidding me? And they said, okay, well, they reached out to us, which was a totally new thing, because, you know, at, at, up to that point, I was still, you know, knocking on doors, trying to get people, and it's just meetings, trying to get roles. Um, so to have, like, such a huge franchise actually reach out to us and, and ask us to audition was like a whole different experience. So I did the audition. It was a little bit of a process. They say they kept looking through auditions and, and they made me aware that Sam kept going back to mine, looking, watching my audition, watching it over and over, and finally got the call. It said, well, Sam would like to meet you. Um, you know, they really want you for the role, but uh, they want to see how you guys get along, make sure you can coexist. <laughs> and I think it's just one of those things, that, again, where people, they just, until they meet me, they don't know what to expect because of, I think, mostly my appearance and my background. You know, I think you know, people think that I'm gonna, rah, 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 I'm gonna be that guy, you know, just not that guy. So anyway, we met and they called and said, well, you, you've got the role and I about crap my pants. <laughs> <laughs> Is this really what you want? Living in the shadows, hunting, being hunted, always alone? I don't stop to think about it. It was me, James. The author of all your pain.